Hey YouTube, so today the April players of the month just dropped. Um, we're going to go through all the new content here. There's new headliners, new events, a bunch of new stuff to go over today. Um, so we're going to get into the video. And if you guys like it, like this video, hit the subscribe button and let's get to it. All right, guys. So to start off here, we have the April monthly awards. We have all of it now, right? So if you remember, we were stuck right here with Michael King. Now it's all unlocked. So we have an 86, Travis Demerite. Uh, he's the Tops Now player. Um, there's an 86, Tyler McGill. He's not very good either. Not really good pitch mix, sadly, even though for how good he's been. Um, and there's also an 86, Willie Adamas. Um, he's okay, if you're, especially if you're like an all-star kind of player and you're at that difficulty. Uh, he's a pretty solid shortstop. Um, but besides that, those are the three Tops Now. But now... Now we get into the 88 overall monthly awards. All right, so the first one we have is Victor Arano for uh, the Nationals. So a righty relief pitcher with 94 hits per nine, slider, sinker, fastball, changeup. Um, pretty good card here, pretty good reliever. He'll be in my bullpen, uh, he'll probably be in yours too. Um, but yeah, pretty good reliever to start. Next we have an 88, JP Crawford, shortstop, lefty bat, throws right. Diamond hitting, diamond defense, not bad. Um, good contact against both sides. Not good power against righties, sadly, which is kind of weird considering he's a lefty. So he's got reverse splits. So that's kind of weird. Um, but good defense. Okay speed. 59 speed is what it is. But another okay card. Uh, Pablo Lopez. That's actually a pretty good card here. I like this card a lot. Um, he has a really good pitch mix. And he also has 92 hits per nine, which is pretty solid so far. So he's a fastball, a circle change, a cutter, a sinker, and a slurve. So pretty good pitch mix for him. Um... He also has pretty good pitch control and okay break on his pitches. I like the 97 break on a circle change. Um, and he has pretty good break on the rest of his pitches as well. Um, so the next one is an 88 Owen Miller. So Owen Miller is a righty. He plays second base. He can also play first, third, and short. So he can play anywhere in the infield. Solid card. Um, 97 uh, right, 77 left, uh, 70 power right, 84 power left with 86 speed and gold defense. So again, not a bad card. Pretty solid card here, actually. Um, if you want to, if you need a new infielder, you're looking for a new second baseman or a new shortstop, you know, go pick him up. Now, Jock Peterson, uh, he rakes against righties. He's going to be a, a bench bat for sure. Put him on your bench when you need to face a, le or a righty late in a game. Put in Jock. That's all he's pretty much good for. Uh, at 48 speed with bronze defense and terrible hitting against lefties. Just sash him on your bench, man. Or honestly, just sell him if you get him, whatever one. Um, Jordan Romano, um, this guy's been actually killing it in real life, but this card's pretty bad considering he has two fastballs on a slider, sadly. So this card's kind of unusable, but 88 Jordan Romano. Um, yeah. So the next ones are the 90 overall monthly awards. Now for these, we have Ty France here, who has 92 uh, contact right, 100 contact left, with 72 power right and 80 power left. Also has silver defense. He's a first baseman, uh, can play second and third as well. Um, again, an okay card, nothing too crazy here, but a solid card nonetheless. Um, Taylor Ward here. Now, this is a guy I like because he can play so many different positions. He can play everyone in the outfield, and he can play catcher, first, and third. Um, diamond hitting as well. It was 71 speed and silver defense, so not that bad. Um, 89 contact right, 80, or 97 contact left, 105 power right, and 70 power left. Uh, again, a pretty good card here. Um, not bad at all. And then we have 90 Kyle Wright. Now, this is probably one of my favorite cards that they dropped in this program. Um, 90 overall pitcher here. 97 hits per nine is really good to start. Um, he also has 81 control with 92 below and 99 break. Um, he, he also has a slurve, fastball, sinker, circle change, and slider. Again, really good pitch mix here. Um, I think he should be in your starting rotation. Uh, there's not many pitchers that are actually better than him right now, unless you have, you know, Randy Johnson and those type of guys. But a pretty solid pitcher. And then, guys, as you see going through here, there are tons and tons of packs from doing this. I mean, tons. Five pack, ten packs. And then now we're going to get on to Andre Dawson. You know he got released before, but here's Andre Dawson. You can finally get him. Um, a solid card. Um, he kind of reminds me of Julio Rodriguez, but a slightly better Julio Rodriguez card. Um, so pretty good card here. And then we have the Lightning player who is 92, Anthony Rizzo. Um, so this Anthony Rizzo card is 81 contact right, 86 contact left, with 100 power from both sides. Um, pretty solid card. It's a little underwhelming, though, for a Lightning card, considering last year, Byron Buxton was a 95 for the first one, and that card was really, really good. So, uh, also a silver defense, but a good card with a good swing. Uh, he'll get some play for now, but I don't think he'll get play for very long, considering he's a first baseman, and there's a lot of first basemen that are honestly better than him, and he has no secondary position. Um, there's also... 
a new headliner pack in the store so if we go here into the store um packs buy packs you will see that there's a 93 Carlos Carrasco who actually is a pretty solid card here right he has fastball changeup slider sinker curveball pretty solid card kind of low hits per nine though uh with 82 hits per nine but a guy with a good pitch mix um and he has good pitch control and really good break on his changeup and slider and curveball so another solid starter probably who probably won't be that expensive either and now there's also one more thing here that is pretty cool this is my probably my favorite thing that they added today and that is the new event so this new event guys um this new event is april monthly awards it's a monthly awards series tops now series and live series players max team overall of 90 overall just regular three inning all-star games pretty uh typical thing for events so once we get through here you will see that we have an event rewind where all the events cards are still in here at 10 wins but then at 15 wins we get a pretty cool card here we get the 91 madison bumgardner so this card is for his two homer game on opening day of back uh, a couple of years ago so he has a fastball a cutter uh whatever that is a slider curve um a circle and then a sinker right so pretty good pitch mix for mad bum um 80 hits per nine not bad but then we want to look at his hitting so for a pitcher man uh it's hard to come by hitting now he's 38 contact and 44 contact but his power is 65 and 69 which is pretty good for a pitcher um so he might get some play as my last guy out of the pen here or out of the rotation um not a bad card and then at the last card at 20 wins is a 91 trevor story diamond hitting diamond defense with 87 speed um pretty low contact versus right 80 contact left with 91 power and 88 power respectively um again a pretty solid card here um there's nothing too crazy to drop today but this event seems pretty cool with all the packs and uh, cards that you can obtain from just grinding this event out i'll be doing this event i think you should too and that guys is all that we have for today um, this is all the new content. If you guys like this video, like the video, hit that subscribe button, hit that noti bell to know when I, my videos go live. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.